Your faith is enough to get you through all that you're facing in your life and will face in the new year. In Mark chapter 9, a man brought his son to Jesus to be healed. He was desperate. He was upset, frightened. And he said in Mark 9, 22 to Jesus, if you can do anything, take pity on us and help us. And Jesus said in verse 23, if you can, anything is possible for the one who believes. That's Jesus, always full of faith. And the man in verse 24 could have said, oh yeah, I'm full of faith too. Yes, praise God. This can happen for sure. I believe that. That's not what he said. Verse 24, immediately the boy's father said, I do believe, help me overcome my unbelief. That's honest. That is honest, real, transparent, authentic. And that's what God wants for you and I. He wants you to be real. You do not have to put on a religious mask or facade and pretend for God. Now, when you walk into your church, you may feel the need to say, oh, good morning. How you doing? I'm fine. How are you? Praise God. When you go to, into, into work, you may feel the need to act more happy and awake than you actually are. You may feel the need to pretend with certain people in your life, family members, but you never have to pretend with Jesus. He wants you to be real, authentic, honest, open, true. The Bible says in the Psalms that he already knows all about you. He knows your hopes and fears. So be real. This man didn't say, oh, yeah, I'm like you, Jesus. I have lots of faith. I'm ready for this. Yeah, you got this. No, he said, I do believe, but help me overcome my unbelief. Or in some translations, help me overcome my doubt. He was honest with Jesus. And Jesus didn't say, oh, you have unbelief. You have some doubts, do you? Well, work on that first, then come back, and then I'll help your son. No, that's not Jesus. It says in Mark chapter 9 that Jesus healed the boy, despite the father having shaky faith. His faith was enough. Your faith is enough. On any given day, you may feel a mixture. You have faith, you believe in God, but you may have some anxiety, some insecurity. I do too. Worse than you, I guarantee it. It's okay. You are enough. Your faith is enough. Thank you, God, that our faith is enough. You don't put us off or send us away because our faith is not on full all the time. Thank you, God, that our faith is enough. Thank you, God, that you don't reject us or cast us away or send us away just because we have some faith with doubt or because we have some belief with some uncertainty. Thank you, God, that you accept us as we are. Thank you, God, that we can be real, genuine, honest, authentic, open, and transparent with you. In Jesus' name, amen.